And as response continues in Milton's aftermath, residents are assessing the damage. Ten of your size Deja Parker spoke to one Hampton Roads native who says he was fortunate it wasn't worse for him in Florida. Milton made landfall Wednesday night as a Category 3 hurricane. Those near Florida's Siesta Key are assessing the damage and getting back on their feet. Hampton Roads native Sam Rizzo currently lives in Orlando and says he's fortunate he didn't experience the devastation that most have. So luckily being in Orlando, not being on the coast, it's not as bad because we're just inland, so it just dies down by then. Rizzo wasn't directly affected by the storm, but many people around him were. At least 3 million customers lost power and crews are working to restore electricity to the area. They're getting it done. I haven't seen like, I've seen power trucks and power companies like going by. So we had a bunch of power men coming through because they were waiting for to see like where their assignments were. And though some are hurting now, Rizzo says he's able to pay it forward in his job serving customers at a local restaurant. Definitely grateful, but also it was nice because being where I am, there's a bunch of hotels. So as the past couple of days, as I'm serving people, they're like, thank you for being open because we're here from St. Pete. We're here from Tampa. We're here from the places that they have to evacuate. So like, it would be nice to be able to like support those people. However, Rizzo says he will be on the lookout because he believes these storms are getting stronger over time. It definitely the storms are getting worse and worse every year. That's for sure. They're getting stronger and it's getting scarier, especially for the people who are on the coast where are really getting affected. And it will be another long road to recovery for the millions affected by Milton. Deja Parker, 10 on your side.